Hey guys, making a quick tutorial explaining what is bug life cycle, also known as defect life cycle. It is basically the journey of the defect life cycle when a bug is found and how that bug is tracked and how it was closed. So I'm going to explain it. I recommend everyone to really understand the bug life cycle especially in interview it is really important to explain the whole process and really tester should know the uh, defect life cycle very well when tester find a defect or bug and logs the defect in defect tracking tool the status is a new then QA lead or project manager will assign the issue to dev lead or any particular developer in my current company our QA lead does not assign the bugs our project manager does that again every company has different process there are no wrong answer here then it goes to uh, open state so in open state, the developer started analyzing and looking into the issue. If the developer thinks that this is not an issue or he or she cannot reproduce the issue, they will reject the issue. Or if it's a duplicate issue, then um, the issue will be closed. Or if it's deferred, then it will be closed. In some companies, actually, uh, it happens in the assigned process. So when bug is new, then it goes to assigned and project manager or QA lead will also look at. So if the bug is not rejected or if it's not a duplicate, then developer uh, will start working on it. In progress, I just put it there for understanding purpose so in this stage they will work on the issue and look for a possible fix when the issue is fixed they will send it to QA for retesting and QA will verify the issue if the issue is not resolved then it will be reopened and it will go to new status and follow the same process and if it's fixed, then it should be closed. And that is bug life cycle. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe.